<laughs> yeah, these stairs are kind of steep. <laughs>
cu ca n-am tine și la clenoci, mă acopăt este n-aș totalul, tendiți alt și un botic, tia deși. Muchísimas gracias, thank you so much. Gracias. Esa es la razón por la cual hacen eso, that's the reason why they, they are doing this. Voy a pasar el micrófono, I'm gonna pass oh my microphone. God. The game, one of the players get decapitated. He's right there. That's from the year 1200. And the city was abandoned in the year 1250. So we don't know wh why uh, was abandoned, but uh, archaeologists think that was a long drought. And a long drought brings uh, long hunger. And the hunger brings uh, uh, rebellions. So uh, it got complicated. The, uh, this pyramid, 1,000 years old, the other building, uh, 800 years old, and in the next 10 days, I'm going to be 53 years old. <laughs> what I'm trying to tell you is this. If I show you a picture of myself when I was 10 years old, I look different. I didn't have a mustache. This pyramid, 1,000 years ago, was painted on red color. Wow. But the rain washed the paint away and the sunken panels were painted on yellow color and the tower have a blue stripe going around, turquoise color. Now, the Mayan people that lives here, uh, their name was Itza, the water magicians. 40,000 people lives here because the water. Amigo, 1,000 years ago, the people looked for water. In Yucatan have no rivers, only cenotes. And Chichen Itza have 14 cenotes. And, and, and if you have 14 cenotes, like the one we went this morning, amigo, that's the place to build the city. Nowadays, the people don't look for water no more. Now the people look for Wi-Fi. <laughs> the pyramid uh, was not founded like this nice. It was founded in terrible bad shape by an American traveler back in 1841. We rescued this image from a book wrote by John Lloyd Stevens, an American traveler that stops here in 1841. He was traveling through Yucatan, El Salvador, Guatemala, and Honduras. But there was no cameras, so they were making watercolors. Can you see the three doorway? The archaeologist in 1924, he hired workers from the community to cut the jungle away. And when they cut the jungle, they took a picture and then looked like this. Wow. It's all crumble. Yeah. But we still see the platforms, the sunken panels, the 91 steps. <laughs> But using the, uh, the evidence plus the chronicle of John Lloyd Stevens, they start the reconstruction. We have an evidence that they, they rebuilt the pyramid. Right here you can tell. They were getting the stones from the ground and putting them back in the correct spot. Building, then there is a space and the round column is a separated building. Rule number two in archaeology in the Mayan culture. If you find a place with too many columns was made for the crowd, but if you find one place with three doorways, with two snakes, then that place is be made for the priest and the ruler. So that is the market right there. Yeah, that is the market. And the archaeologists estimate that if one day there was a human sacrifice, the human sacrifice was not right here, was right there. Can you see the two columns? 
they are two snakes. The snake have the mouth open. Can you see? Yeah. And right in between the two snakes, there's a human figurine. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and that human figurine uh, is, is holding a tray on top of the two hands. And right there in that tray, there's a hollow spot big enough for one human heart and blood. Uh, the ball game, the ring uh, that you see on the wall, according with the uh, first archaeologist, the players let the ball bound and hit the ball with a hip, and the ball is supposed to pass through there because uh, they found in a, a stone carving, and the stone carving have this. This is the recreation of the stone. And you can see how the player uh, tie a, a cushion on a hip. So then uh, when, when he hit the ball, he don't get uh, hurt very much on a hip because the ball was heavy. We're talking about six pounds heavy or probably more. Don't kick him, don't kick him, you pigeon kicker. <laughs> Ooh, something smells good. Mm. Yeah, a little lime sauce, a little lime juice. Oh my god, sauce? I can't yeah. wait. I can't wait. I'm so hungry. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.